Hi everybody! Well, I went and did it. I went back to the mother of all yard sales today and the goodies that are in this bag. Um, I paid a whopping $12 for everything. Um, so that was pretty good. Got this little purse that is going to, I love the shape of it, that is going to be so much fun to alter. There's that. I got the Avon Royal Coach um, decanter. And this actually has foaming bath oil in it, and it needs to be cleaned up a little bit, but how stinking cute is that? I absolutely love that. They had a whole box of the decanters, but um, that was really the, the only one that I really liked. It smells good. <laughs> and I got this old clock. I haven't plugged it in yet to see what the deal is, but that is just too cool. So I'm sure I'll be altering that at some point, too. And then this little heart jewelry box, and there's a little bit of jewelry in it. And I haven't gone through it yet. But I saw this piece of bling on top, and I said, well, I like the box, so I'm just going to go ahead and take it, and what's inside is a bonus. Yummy! Some uh, miscellaneous chain. This an earring, and that'll be cool to hang off a piece of something. Oh, this is actually an earring too. Oh. Sparkly! <laughs> okay, this is missing a rhinestone, but that's really cute. This is like, like a um, chain type earring. That's pretty cool. Earring. Oh, that's pretty. And all the rhinestones are actually still in it. Oh, yes, this is a good little box. Earring. Oh, there's the match to it. Another earring. This is missing a little pearl, but that'll be easy enough to replace. That's uh, that's a funky looking earring. I would imagine it goes this way. Everything slide around, but there's the mate to that other one. There's another earring. Kinds of cool dangly stuff in this little box. That's pretty with a pink stone. This was a nice little find. Another earring. Well, there's the mate to the pearl and uh. And a little rhinestone one, but 
all the little bits except for one little rhinestone are missing from that. But that doesn't mean it couldn't be filled up with something if, if I'm using it on a project. And that's a match, and that's a match. Little piece of watch. <laughs> little fish. And just uh, chain earrings. So that little box was worth it. And then a couple of uh, loose pieces. This um, dancer brooch. Love her skirt. That's just too cool. Another brooch. Whoops! There that goes. I'll get it in a second. This is missing one stone. Two stones. So it can be broken apart, but that's way cool. Little uh, rhinestone sweater clip. And a pair of earrings. And those are in really good shape. But hang on a second. Let me uh, grab that brooch. I shouldn't be doing this video today because I still have a lot to do to get ready for tomorrow, but there's the brooch. And then um, the two jars <coughs> excuse me, that I showed in the first video full of the junk jewelry. There's some really good stuff in there. So I'm going to go ahead and, uh, and do that, show you some highlights. These are pieces that'll be good for mixed media. This is uh, beads and buttons. Chain. Okay, flower centers. I'll dump these out because there are some cool ones in here. Little earrings. Actually, I'm going to re angle here and try to zoom in so that maybe I don't have to pick up every piece. There you go. And that way you can be look at, looking at it while I'm picking through it. Then I'll make a cute mold for resin. And that one too, nice medallion. That'll be cool to put some kind of stone or even just a flat back in the center of that. But that rim has a lot of good texture on it. And there's a pair. These are acrylic, but they're they're cute. And that's a bunch of itty bitty beads. So that's got a lot of good texture. That's like a perfect flower center. Here's another cute one. Flower center or embellishment. This one's missing a stone. Almost all the little stones are one of the bigger stones, but for flowers, not a big deal. You can always put something in them. I thought that was neat, neat too, the dimension on it. And there's a cool one. So that's the ones that are pretty much designated for flower centers. And then we get to the, uh, the cool stuff. 
Okay, there were some loose rhinestones, so I haven't determined where they go yet, so I've put them in a bag, keep keeping them inside with it. Fun, fun, fun! The porcelain thimble. Little cameo stick pen. This is a purse hook. I haven't taken it out yet, but it's got a pretty design in it. It's a little set. Of white flowers, the brooch, and a pair of earrings. Earring. Yeah, this one's missing a couple stones. I don't know if I'll be able to do something with this or not because of the odd shape of the stone, but the shape of the piece itself is pretty cool. I'm guessing this is a pendant, but it's really pretty. And that one's a lot of fun. And this necklace is pretty cool. Just, um, it's got some cool pieces in the chain, and then I can't think of what this part is called that's actually holding the uh, holding the bead, but that's pretty cool. Love that. A blingy button. That's a pretty piece. I'm really surprised that still has all the rhinestones on it. That's an earring. And this, I believe, matches it does. It matches the uh, the necklace. So it's uh, the earrings that go with the necklace and then another little two-piece or part of it. I know there was two of those. Here it is. So very cool. I can pop out the stones from this little two-piece or if I want to to get that necklace back to whole. That's an awesome vintage earring. Another earring. This is a ring that is missing uh, like three of the rhinestones and the centerpiece, but I'm sure something can be done with that. It's pretty cool. I haven't haven't gotten out the magnifying glass or anything. Even the de the detail work on the band. Hope you can see that, but that's really pretty. Love this little, little earring. And this one, the uh, the petals of the flower are plastic, but I mean. That's just fun. <laughs> this one's missing a large stone also, but it's a it's a cool piece. 
No reason why you can't tuck that behind something on a project and have the rest of it peeking out. That's a cool earring. Little bracelet and the little stones on it are kind of cool. There's a little bit of iridescence to them. Showed you that one. There's a pair of these um, butterfly hair clips or hair pins. And this is an another ring setting that's kind of cool, and I may have a little cameo that will fit right in there. But again, that, that, that's got some uh, some nice detail work on it. Nice design work. Christmas tree earring. There's actually a pair of these and all the stones are intact, which is amazing. Love those. And this feels like resin. And it has a little stone in it. And it's a apparently popped off of something but it's an old lily flower <laughs> old doodad flower so I thought that was pretty cool this piece oh wait a second I hadn't thought about this before I don't know if it opens or no I'm going to find it no okay it doesn't open but made to look like a watch face, but there, there's nothing inside of it. It's actually a keychain, but could very easily put an image inside of that, which would be very cool. And then there's the back of it. A small key. Tiny, tiny rose with a pearl center. Not sure what this was supposed to be, but it's kind of neat. I love the patina on this, and that is one heavy earring. And a couple of leaves with a couple little stones. I can't tell from here if it's focusing or not, so I'm, I'm hoping it is. This is a bracelet and all the stones are intact. It's a cool earring. Another earring. And another one. This one's missing a couple of little rhinestones that needs most of this is in serious need of uh, major bath. <laughs> and this is a brooch, and it looks like there was probably something in the center of it at one time, but that's a cool piece. And this is a small shoe clip. I love these. pair of earrings. And another pair that are, or is this the same pair as earlier? I thought I was putting all this stuff to the side, but maybe I didn't. Okay. Yeah, this is another pair that is amazingly, all the stones are intact. That one's kind of funky different. And this pair. Super cool. I 
with the brooch. Earring. Another earring. Little guardian angel. Earring. Cool to mention on that too. Love this one. Single earring. No pair on that. And brooch that's missing a couple of stones. This doesn't have any kind of back on it to know if it was an it was probably an earring but this is actually this is actually a really good idea if you know how sorry about that how we've all been making little beaded flower centers and everything this actually has rondelles in between the pearls that makes so much sense but very cool There's a uh, stick pen. A pair of butterfly earrings. Earring. Scarf clip. And a stick pen with nothing in the bezel, so I can put whatever I want in there, which is pretty cool. And then just a couple of um, stray rhinestone earrings. This pen I thought was kind of cool, just the, uh, the texture of the metal, and I'm hoping it's going to show up. I get close so that hopefully you can see the detail. It helps if I turn it the right way, doesn't it? Where are you? There we go. Thought that was way cool. <laughs> Fun junk ring. That'll be good for an art I make. And then this little bag where you can, I guess, make uh, make your own little ornaments. But it's got little metal pieces in it and uh, plastic beads and some pens. So that is the jewelry haul. That's uh, that's it for Mother of All Yard Sales 2013 and I'm gonna get myself back to work. <laughs> Thanks for stopping by. Hope it doesn't take you too long to dry yourselves off. <laughs> we'll talk to you soon. Thanks for watching. Take care. Bye-bye.